Hello, how y'all doing today? This is Kay. Happy Monday, everybody. Just getting home from work. I got a small home, and we're going to do the daily bread. Let me turn my prayers down. Thank you. Hope y'all having an amazing day. Let's pray. Like this is stuff come off my shoes. That's why when I do when I do get my place, y'all, no shoes. I promise you I sleep every single day. If I walk in, it's something I always come off my shoes on the floor. And I have to get it. I have to get it. Okay. All right, I had to cut that down for a little bit. Cut my lights on. The air ain't working. It's 82 degrees in my room. Which is not, it's not hot to me. Because I like to be warm anyway. I've been in the air all day. All right, how y'all doing? Oh, I forgot to daily bread. Yeah, it's been an amazing day. It went by quick. I went in at five again this morning. I said I wasn't going in at five no more, but I, I went in at five. Okay. It is Monday the 9th at 1.33 p.m. So my small haul today, I had already had this cheese, but I'm getting ready to go put my stuff in the oven as we speak. Miss K got one of her favorites. Y'all ain't seen these in a while. The Canadian style bacon and pineapple pizza. But I add my own anchovies. Y'all know I love anchovies. So I'm going to put anchovies on it. And... This cheese, and I'm gonna this time I'm gonna do something different. I'm gonna add these little bit of bacon bits just to get rid of them because I got them. So we're gonna put that on the pizza. And look what I got. I found these on sale. Y'all ain't gonna believe it. I never had it before. Coffee. And this one is latte rich and creamy cinnamon toast crunch. For $5.75. It was on sale. I guess they was getting rid of it or whatever. And I got the Snickers. $5.75. Coffee, y'all. Snickers. Oops. Snickers. I can't wait to try these. We're going to have one of these today. Most definitely. So that's the pizza and the coffee. And I wanted my daughter to uh, try these waters. I only got a couple of them. I got me one. And then I got some pineapple coconut water. I got her two of those. See if she like them. Because you know I'm taking her to the doctor in the morning. So I'm going to put them in the freezer. Let them get nice and cold. Frozen. And then take them to her so she can take one with her. Okay, so this is my work bag. And then I also i am going to bake... But that thing gone. This is all left, y'all. Look, of the uh, butterscotch chocolate chip I shared. So I had to get me some more vanilla extra extract. <laughs> I haven't even said I say it. <laughs> and I had to get me some more nutmeg. Y'all know this little old thing of nutmeg was seven dollars. I ain't know it was that much. I got some in here, but I'm gonna need a little bit more. And you know I'm gonna bake some more, so. Those two items right there. And Miss K was out of butter. So I got butter because I'm going to bake one today. This one kind of going to be for my daughter. And um, I got me some creamer to go with my new coffee I'm going to try today. So that's it for my small haul, y'all. Yeah, this is trash. I'm going to throw these bags away because I got so many of them. I'm going to just throw this in the trash. And that's it. My little small house. I got my bananas already good and ripe and ready. Ooh, I'm going to make a good one today. I'm going to take my time. Don't rush. Don't forget nothing. Because I forgot the uh, vanilla extra yesterday. Okay, now let's get into the daily bread. Okay. And pull phone. All right, let's get into it. Woo-sa, woo-sa. God is good, y'all. If I said or done anything to offend anyone, I apologize. In the name of Jesus, forgive me for my sins, Father God. And I'm doing that for a reason because I, I wasn't rude, but, you know, sometimes people, 
oh, they just extra. And then we have to know how to act too. You know what I'm saying? Instead of, you know, making a face or making a gesture or saying something under your breath, just don't do it. Just If somebody being disrespectful or rude, just let them. And you just smile your way on through it. That's what I usually do. But today, I, you know, I kind of made a face back like, you, know, you can read my face. Just put it like that. Don't be so easily read. Okay, good. All right, now let's get into this. This is going to be coming out of Proverbs 19 and 2. Also, that the soul be without knowledge. It is not good. And he that hasteth with his feet sinneth. Okay. So often we might jump into action without having truly considered the best approach or without having even looked to God for guidance. Those who seek counsel first with the Lord to have their souls first filled with wisdom will also please the Lord. Do not hasten selfishly and overconfidently into situations for they may lead you to shut yourself off from him and lead to sins or greater troubles. Rather, have trust in the Lord who will show you the way. Lord above, almightiest of fathers, grant me the patience to hear your wisdom spoken to me at, at every occasion. Ensure that I remain always open to your guidance and not close within my own self selfish desires. For you see and know always what to do, and you are the ultimate power with dominion over all. For this, I thank you and praise you each and every day. Amen. Mm, prayer is powerful. Yeah, I needed this right here today. Yes. Those who seek counsel first with the Lord to have their souls first filled with wisdom well, also please the Lord. Do not hasten selfishly and overconfidently into situations. Yes, thinking you know it and all oh, you got it and all oh, and all that. That's right. Now, I hope y'all enjoyed the daily bread. Miss K ain't even playing. We not playing. We not playing today. I'm ready for that pizza. I'm thinking if I should spray this Pam on here. I don't think I should. Mm -hmm. I think the last time I did it, it stuck. I think it did. I ain't gonna do it. All right, to the kitchen we go. Look, I ain't even playing. Got the pan and everything. I'll see y'all on the next one and have a blessed day. Peace.